What's up guys, this is Dario and I recently bought a 5-in-1 USB-C dongle for the new MacBook series with USB-C ports for around 8 bucks on AliExpress. Since Apple's original dongles cost around $70, let's see if this cheap alternative is actually worth your money. Let's first talk about the build quality of this USB-C dongle. The dongle has a robust and sturdy aluminium casing which has a flat silver color finish which is quite similar to the silver color on the MacBook. The cable has also a very good quality and it's also quite flexible so I believe it won't get easily worn out. The USB-C connector has also a high quality finish so you should be able to plug it in in your USB-C enabled device without any problems. And overall, this USB-C dongle has a very compact size because it's slightly thicker than your 2017-18 MacBook Pro, so it should fit in your pocket or your backpack without any problems. Let's also talk about the bad stuff. The plastic masks on the front and back of the dongle are made from a very cheap plastic. The version of the dongle that I have here with me has a slight bump on the back cover but I didn't see that it caused any connectivity problems. On the front mask, the two USB-A connectors don't seem completely aligned, so be very careful and double check when plugging in your USB cables for the first time because you might damage the connectors of the device that you're trying to plug in. In terms of the port selection, we have a USB-A 3.0 and also a 2.0 port. We have a full-sized SD card slot, also a micro SD card slot and a USB type B port. Let's also now see how this USB dongle performs. The dongle is compliant with USB 3.0 standards and also supports speeds up to 5 gigabits per second. At least that's what it claims on the packaging. I'm gonna be performing this test with a SanDisk Extreme Pro 3.0 USB stick with 128 gigabytes of capacity. The advertised speed for this USB stick is a write speed of up to 240 megabytes per second and a read speed of up to 260 megabytes per second. The tool that I'm gonna be using to benchmark this is a Blackmagic disk speed test. I'm gonna be performing this benchmark on two devices. On a 2015 MacBook Pro 15 inch with an i7 and on a 2017 MacBook Pro 13 inch base model. So when performing this test on the 2015 MacBook Pro, I got the following results. A write speed of 230 megabytes per second, a read speed of 247 megabytes per second, which is quite close to the advertised USB stick performance. When taking this same USB stick and plugging it into the USB-C dongle on the 2017 MacBook Pro 13 inch, I got the following results. So a write speed of 227 megabytes per second and a read speed of 247 megabytes per second, which is again very close to the advertised speed and also very close to the speed that I achieved on the 2015 MacBook Pro 15 inch. So in general, I think this USB-C dongle shouldn't represent any bottleneck when connecting your USB accessories to it. Additionally, this USB-C dongle should work with your smartphones that have a USB-C port. I tested it with my Samsung Galaxy S8 and it worked without any problems. In terms of the price, this USB-C dongle will cost you $7.98 with free shipping included on AliExpress. Ok, conclusion time. So in my opinion, this is a decently built USB-C dongle with a very compact size that delivers the speed that an average consumer would need. Also, it will probably be good enough for professionals. The affordable price of $7.98 is very competitive, taking into account that the Apple equivalent is at least $70. Of course, you can find the link to the USB-C dongle in the description below. So there you have it. If this video helped you, leave a like and don't forget to subscribe as I have more content coming up. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.